So, what's the deal between you and that lady teacher? We're colleagues, as of a few days ago. The fuck are you talking about? Stay out of this, Akutsu. Huh? I'm telling you to shut up and leave this to me. I'm focusing. Besides, Yagami-san here is telling us the truth. <laughs> He's just being a little vague, is all. So what do you mean, Sawa-sensei is your colleague? I was asked to look into a bullying case at Serio High. That's all I meant by it. How about that? What'd you do to her? Oh, she's sound asleep now, I'm sure. Our business isn't with her, anyway. You want Kiwana? Right. About that. You keep calling him Kuwana. That's not who we know him as. Huh? Kuwana is his alias. A fake name? That's right. So tell me, what is he? What do you know him for? You get two seconds to answer. Hmm. What does this Kuwana guy do? He's a handyman. In Ijincho. Everybody knows him. He's been taking jobs in the area for a long time now. A handyman, huh? Well, from the way it sounds, you haven't known each other very long. <sighs> yeah. His real name's Kitakata. Ring any bells? Well, there you have it. Your face says you have no idea what the hell I'm talking about. <laughs> so then, any idea where your Kuwana-san went? We have some business with him. I wouldn't tell you even if I knew. Of course you wouldn't. And I suppose that's not a lie. But it's probably more accurate to say you don't know where he is, either. Turns out you don't have a damn thing on him. <sighs> Shit. Know what that means? <sighs> it means you have no more use for me. Shame to be smart and still lose, huh? Now, I got a question for you. Did you really think you'd walk out of here alive? Or is it gonna be in a body bag? The fear what in are we gonna eyes do? tells me everything I need to know. And you're probably right. <laughs> you aren't gonna enjoy what little time you have left. It's gonna be painful as hell. Because I'll be the one enjoying it. What brings you to a gene show and after a teacher? And why Kawana too? How do you even know him? I could tell you his little part and give, couldn't I? Except I ain't feeling so generous. <laughs> But you didn't think we were done yet, did you? <laughs> hey! Fire that thing up! Get him on his feet! And I don't want to see him squirming. Oh, shit! Not every day you get a chance like this! Record this shit! Yo! How quickly can a chainsaw killer guy should be the video title when we upload it? This kind of shit gets so many views. Am I right, Yagami? We'll go in slow and get your fingers all cut to shreds. <laughs> we'll take that up to the right wrist, then we'll switch over to the left side. Right forearm, 
left forearm. Why don't we make this formal? Take first dibs. You show us how it's done. You, you want me to do it? Time to man up. We gotta show the world what happens when you fuck with R.K. Killing shits like him is what puts hair on your chest, guys. Just try not to kill him until everyone gets a turn. Get to work! But, but sir... Figure it out. Akutsu. He won't do it himself, you know. <laughs> Recording it puts the evidence of a murder out there on video. And he won't be on it. But you guys will be. Who do you think they'll come for, moron? You still talking? Fill your intestines on the fucking floor! Thank God. Yo! We've got company! Uh, Kaito? How the hell? How'd you fucking find us here? Uh, Kaito san. Sekiro? Suppose I ought to thank you boys for keeping Tuck nice and comfortable, Akutsu. Yeah, but we were just getting to the grand finale. You two can have front row seats. I'll pass. This show kind of sucks. Block all the doors! These three are fucking dead. You hear me, boys? I don't want anyone leaving the building! Good call. I don't want anyone leaving either. Not until I'm done with you. <laughs> Don't be a tough guy, Tak. Feel free to take a breather if you need to. I don't know about that, Kaito-san. He's got that look. That's the face he makes when he's got a score to settle and some ass to kick. <laughs> you still haven't gotten your fill of this, Yagami? <laughs> I'll admit, this is kind of fun, man. Maybe killing you would be a mistake. I've got an even better idea. I'll tie you up and keep you as a pet. You know what? I think I could punch you as many times as I want right now. But in circumstances such as they are, no one could even blame me. Huh? I'm saying I've earned a little payback, Akutsu. Let's go! I'm gonna shove that chainsaw right up your ass, bro. Alright. Let's go. Let's go. Do this. Come on. Let's work the room. Come on.
Here we go. Nice. Buddy. Nice. Take him down, Kaito Sark. Yeah. Dumb, buddy. What the hell does RK want with Kuma? What did he do? Tell me how Sawa Sense and Kawana are connected. You ask too many questions, you fucking asshole. <laughs> Tell me, why go to all the effort in Kamurojo to find Shinya Kawai? What are you trying to do? Oh, shit. <laughs> I'll get you! Man, that guy's invincible. And he's faster than he looks. Asshole. He knew it was a lost cause, so he took off at the first opportunity. I'm guessing that's why he was holding back. Are you serious? He couldn't be that sharp. Nah. He's definitely got some skills. And we better start taking him seriously. Man. I'm just glad you had the mind to tip off Kaito-san that I wasn't picking up your calls. That got Tsukumo to track my phone over GPS and locate me using the town security cameras. Long story short, you saved me. I had to try something. I'm the one who dragged you into this after all. But you know, the first person to suspect something was Higashi-san. He thought it was strange for you to be suddenly unavailable. <laughs> Better thank him too. By the way, I'd like to share the details I recently gathered on Shinya Kawai. Kawai was a bully at Kurokawa Academy. Five years ago, he was abducted by individuals thought to be his acquaintances. A worker at a girls' bar witnessed this, and based on that, RK apparently deduced that Kawai was murdered. Got it. Then I suggest you steer clear of RK as much as possible. They fly off the handle faster than the Yakuza. Right. I never imagined things would get this dangerous. We just got back to Sawa Sensei's apartment. I thought RK was in Kamurocho looking for Kawai. But they came to ambush a handyman named Kawana. Did you say handyman? <laughs> yeah, but he plays a wider field than your average Mr. Fixit. He's popular on the Jincho Underground. Even Kawana was a fake name. And this mystery man has some connection to Sawa Sensei? Yeah, and I'm about to ask her about him directly. I need to get everything I can out of her this time. Understood. We're still dealing with a lot of unknowns, so take care of yourself, okay? I'll be all right. I'm with two guys I can trust now. Yo, what's Sawa Sensei's room number? Just hold your horses. I'm <laughs> coming with you. <laughs> wow. All right, we're going to head up and talk to uh, 
Kaiwa-san. Or Sawa-san, not Kaito. I, yeah. I'm horrible with names. Sawa. Sawa-san. If she's still alive. Sure is quiet. This is where the fight went down? Yeah. But to look at it, you wouldn't think anything had happened here. <clears throat> Sawa Sensei, you there? Jagami. What's up? The door. It's unlocked. Huh? Sawa Sensei? No, we talk. He killed her. Okay, so that's the end of chapter 7.